Hello and welcome back to another episode of City Bus Manager and today is day 10. Now, a couple of issues have arisen on the network and I'll explain why. Because um, I've done something to kind of make my public transport a bit more enticing and when I mean that, I mean I have reduced my tickets drastically to the point where it's effectively cheapest chips to ride my buses. But if I do it that, look at the patronage in regards to revenue. 51% increase in single tickets and a 34% increase in short distance tickets. So like a short hop. 40% on day tickets. And the weekly tickets are roughly about the same. But that I imagine that will increase somewhere along the line. But... The effect that's had on my on my network is tr pretty drastic. So, if I show you, so the C1 Cafiti is fine. We got big buses on that. That's not a problem. All right. The same with the Porth. The Porth one is fine. The 100 Nelson, though, however, is getting a bit, um, yeah, it's get is get <laughs> it's getting a bit of a difficult one because I mean, look at that. So we need big buses for the 100 Nelson now. We, we that's. There is no ifs or buts about it. We need big buses for Nelsons. So every time a Nelson turn comes up, we need big buses. The 101. The University Shuttle. Oh my Jesus. Oh my. Just... <laughs> we're going to have to increase... The, we're going to have to increase this every half an hour. We've got no choice. Look at the numbers. When I increase it... When I decrease the ticket numbers, look at the numbers. That is insane. And then Kodja Kamoyes. Don't get me wrong, it's every 20 minutes, so it's fine, okay? But still, look at the numbers going up. And then, of course, we got the 103, that's fine, doesn't need anything. But the 104, oh my days. Look at that, we left almost, well, just under 50 people behind. But there, we left over 50 people behind. And but there, we left 33 behind. Crazy, we can't be having that on our network, we just can't. And again, the 112 tasks well. I mean, this runs every half an hour. We're going to have to increase it every 20 minutes. We've got no choice. We have to. Because look at the numbers on it. It's insane. So today is going to be mainly about timetable work. So we've got our route. So the first one we had to look at was the... So the 100 Nelson's fine. We just need the bigger buses. The 101. So let's edit the timetable. Because just insane. I just was not expecting this to be so busy. I really wasn't. And we, I'm even considering putting a Sunday service on it as well. Um... And as well as that, increasing the time. So, yeah, we're going to start doing that today. All right, so this one's going to run every 30 minutes between 05.35 until, um, well, until 19.35, I would say. Um, that's fine. So, daytime. I'm actually going to turn this into an, I'm actually going to turn this into an evening, um, service as well because i just have i just have no choice it is it's mental <laughs> just the numbers on you are crazy so 1935 and then 2035 we're gonna go to every hour um and this can run up until not super late like the other ones okay but you know late enough you know just so we've got two evening shuttles all right so every 60 minutes so that will be monday to friday um even oh Let's put a capital. Do you know I like my capitals? Evening. Um, just to abbreviate. Let's check the timetable as well. So copy and paste. Here we go. Um, Otley Arms. So that needs to be the Otley Arms. There we go. So that's our money to Friday. So yeah, every half an hour. We're going to see how that turns out. Okay. And then is every hour over there. And then a new timetable. We're going to do... Oh, sorry. That meant to be a Saturday as well. Um, so that should be that should be Saturday, um, and then we're gonna actually we're actually gonna implement a Sunday service on this on this one hundred one because it needs a. So if we do it nine till five. So how about we do no actually how about we do eighteen fifty to sixteen fifty and it's gonna run every every hour. So if we have a look at the timetable now, there goes. Got a Sunday service, and there we go. Look, the network is a bit more reliable now. So it's every half an hour rather than every hour. So that's just one issue that I've had. So let's confirm that. And then we need to do. So we've done the 101. 102 is fine. 103 is fine. The 104. We need to make that every half an hour as well. Just crazy enough. It's not a. It's not a. It's not a bad little problem to have. In all fairness, it's really not. Um, so if we make that every 30 minutes, 
and then that's made to Saturday. We're gonna have we're gonna edit this one, so it's gonna be um, this is gonna be Monday to Saturday evening. Because again, it needs a later service, um, so that's gonna be we're gonna increase the thing on that as well to eighteen twenty five. And then this one will be 1925 until again we're not gonna have it run super late okay but that could probably go another hour and then this one could go over there and then that seems fine to me um 30 minutes 30 minutes that's fine so yeah and then we're gonna do a new timetable sunday timetable and this one obviously will be every hour so, again, I can't remember what the timings were. So, 25, 25. So, this will be um, 08 to 25 until 16.25. So, that could be that. Every 60 minutes. That's great. So, let's have a look at the timetable. Again, more reliability for that. So, we're increasing the network on that. And then it comes to that and then is every hour. So, Sunday service. Great. Fab. Confirm. 104 we've done that one so the 105 is fine the 112 was um 112 we need to make that every 20 minutes don't we so um does it need to be every 20 minutes though from the start i don't think it does does it so um if we do 6 30 that could be every 20 minutes and then that could be every half an hour we do that and then what we're going to do we're going to add two new timetables okay so it's going to be Monday to Friday morning Friday no Friday morning so if we go back on that one so it was 0430 wasn't it so 0430 until it would be would it be oh yeah it'd be 06 that could be every half an hour um, Monday to Friday it's just copy and paste the timetable for that. Here we go. Uh, Monday to Friday morning. So every half an hour. Then that is every 20 minutes. And then the evening then is every half an hour. So then we need to add. This can go down to every half an hour. That can go down to every hour. Um, Saturday. Sunday. Sunday is fine. Doesn't need to change Sunday. So we need to add a... What do we need to add? I just had it in my head. What do we need to add? Um, 18.30. Every 30 minutes. Oh, yeah. And then this one will be the Monday to Friday. Right. Night. Um, so it needs to be 21.30. Timetable work is my favourite, you know. It really is. I love timetable work. And you can go to half past here we go every 60 minutes again copy and paste here we go so let's have a look at the timetable now so just to make it a bit more reliable half an hour 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 20 minutes there we go so see how is every half an hour there and then all of a sudden it goes to 20 minutes so and then we come to the end of the evening so 20 minutes 20 minutes oh that's an hour 20 minutes. So that needs to be 19. Okay. So I've made a booby there, haven't I? So, um, so that needs to go up until, let's have a little look, think. So that needs to go up until 7 o'clock, doesn't it? If we do 17.10, how does that do it? Um, 20 minutes, 20, half an hour, half. Yep, that's perfect. Great. There we go. Perfect. So that that was right. Okay, bro. Let's confirm that. Let's have a look at the Sunday timetable. Make sure it's all good. Yeah, that's fine. Every hour now. And then that one. Every half an hour on a Saturday. It doesn't need anything more than that. Um, yep, that's fine. Great. Yep, I'm happy with that. Confirm. So there we go. So straight away now, my buses are going to be rammed with uh, <laughs> with passengers 
But the good thing is, the more reliable and the more, you know, the more thing you make it, then the more passengers you're going to have. So if you coincide that with the cheap tickets that I've done, it's just going to be a game changer. So let's just see how my morning turnout goes, shall we? Or shall we add in another route before we do anything? Because I'm kind of feeling that, you know? Um, I tell you what, no, let's just let it run. We need to wash all these buses anyway, so... Problem is, though, if I start washing them now, are they going to make more in turn out? don't think they will. That one can do with a wash. That one could do with a wash. That one's fine. Um, oh, God, that needs to be cleaned inside. Why haven't that been cleaned yet? Um, washed outside. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine as well. Here we go. These ones are clean, I think. Because I'm sure I did this in the previous episodes. Yes, they're all clean. Yeah, well, they're all clean in a way anyway. So, Right, I need some replacement parts as well because um, I don't want to get into the stage where I'm begging for parts to be delivered to me. So if we get quite a lot. Wiper, um, router, brake pads, tyres, oil canister, and then a V-belt. So how many items is that? It's quite a lot, isn't it? Should have... Should have enough spaces for all them. Yeah, we should have enough spaces. So yeah, that'd be good. Right. Okay. Let's fast forward this a little bit now. So let's just time. Can I time jump? I don't think I can yet because I've got all that going on. Okay, that's fine. Review my staff. 36 drivers. I probably need to hire more drivers in all fairness. So let's hire some more drivers. You are a terrible driver, but I'm going to... Actually, no, that's a mechanic. Here we go. Let's get the right one for a start. Um... 1370. Okay, let's... Hang on, I'm sure I've given my drivers a pay rise. Yes, I have. I have given them a pay rise. So, hire employees, let's have a little look. So, I'm sure if they're novice or under, if they're expert, they get 1420. If they're advanced, 1320, okay. What are you? You're novice, so you get... Um, 1250. Let's have a little look, yeah. Twelve fifty you get. Um you are trainee, so I'm sure trainees get even less. <laughs> Might be wrong. Um Let's have a little look. Um So I don't want to pay him more than what I need to, you know? So novice, novice, okay. Yeah, so novice are under twelve fifteen hour. Okay, so just just so I got clarity on that. Um, let's pause that. I don't want to miss turn out. <laughs> oh, let's give you twelve fifty because you're really really friendly. So let's give you twelve fifty an hour. Um, let's give you twelve fifteen hour as well. How many drivers have I got now? Thirty nine. So I need one more ideally. Uh, again, you're super friendly. So let's give you that. Fab, so I got 40 drivers now. God, my depot's getting big. 40 drivers, Jesus, wet. So, um, so that's not in service C1 and then the 112. So that can be a small bus because you're every half an hour now. So C1, you need to have a big bus so you can have the branded one at the end. 112, Taswell, 104. Okay, you can have... Mm, I'm wondering if it's worth putting these... Putting these out today, yeah. We'll put them out. Uh, again, 102, not in service. 100 Nelson, 112 Taswell. You can have that bus. C1. You can have that one. College of Kamoid. You can have the branded 102. Ooh, more, more, more. P1 Porth, 101, University 105. So that needs a small bus. 102 College of Kamoid. You need a, you need a branded. C1 Cafeti, you need a branded. Here we go. Great. So I'm just really interested to see how um, my network copes now with the sudden influx of passengers because I've decided to reduce my tickets quite drastically. 112, P1, 101, 105. You can have a small one. Uh, P1, 100s. Ooh. Which Nelson do you do? You do the 0815 one. And then you do the 101 straight after him. So you can have um you can have a big bus. Well bigger bus anyway. And then you can go again on the branded but they. So that should be all my 102 turnouts done. Just think I've got one more C1 to do. 
you can have you can have that one one thing I want to do as well, see how many buses I need per day, because obviously I want to add in another route. I want to add in two, because look how close, 0, .0 well, 0.2% away from that, and that is just terribly frustrating. <laughs> it's just my rotten luck, to be honest with you. Let's see if, no, they haven't been delivered yet. Okay, that's fine. There we go. There's my last uh, C1 Cafiti to be released. There we go. Bang. These C1 buses are beautiful. I love Scania's, i got to be honest with you. They're just epic buses. So, speaking of Scania's, let's see if there's any available. Got plenty covered in bird poo. Um, right, you need a big bus. Which one is that one? Ah, yes. You need that one, the Scania. Okay, let's go back to buses. So, let's get this one covered in poo. Um, 14, let's have a look what's wrong with it. There's quite a lot wrong with this, so let's offer him 30 and a half. Here we go. That's one. Any more Scania's? No, I've just got Sataros. I could maybe get some Sataros, but I don't know. I like Scania's, personally, but, you know, but Sataros are pretty good to have as well. So, let's clean, wash, repair you, give a new engine. Uh, let's just replace them. The oil is fine, so that's... That's good. But we got replacement parts coming, so I'm not really concerned about that, if I'm honest with you. But yeah, look at it. Just covered in bird dollar. <laughs> so unfortunate. <laughs> Any more? Sometimes it refreshes straight away. Sometimes it doesn't. I mean, I could get some Sitaros, couldn't I? Could maybe get some Sitaros. How many spaces have I got? Um, let's have a little think. So there should be a Scania allocated to that. There should be two. So I got one, two, three, four, five. I got five spaces allocated, so I could maybe get some Sataros in. That'd be a good idea. Um, let's have a little think about this, though. So, preferably the 85 Peter will do. So, yeah, let's get that one. Let's offer you... Let's offer you 14. And then this one, let's offer you... Let's offer you 15.8. There we go. Accepted. Brilliant. So that's the 85C capacity ones. There they are. Look at these beautiful Sitaros. So we'll get the brand inside on these very soon. But obviously these buses are out of action right now. But yeah. Lovely buses. Really good buses. Right, let's have a look how my network's doing. So buses, buses. 105 is full to the brim. Lovely. Okay. Problem is I can't put I can't put a big bus on the 105. That is the issue. I just can't do it. Well, the 100 is rammed to the brim. So if I have a look, have I left any passengers behind so far? Considering it's only the first couple of services. Oh my god! I left passengers behind on that one. No. But why, though? My bus should have been able to handle that. That's crazy. Terribly unfortunate as well. But it is what it is. We'll just have to sort this out. Um, you can go... Well, you can go over there. Um, the, other the other brand one can go up next to it. Uh, let's refuel you. And then we'll paint you after. So, I mean, considering... Okay, I've increased all my services. I've still got quite, I've still got quite a few buses left to allocate. So, I mean, probably got enough room to add in a couple more routes. So I've got the drivers at the minute, which is good. I've got plenty of drivers. Ah, here's my delivery of stock. There we go, working hard, putting them away. Great stuff. Wow, that's gonna be a busy one. That's gonna be a really busy one. So let's give you that one. What do you need for that one? 102, Kodja Kamoi. Okay, that's fine. C1. I got a branded C1 by there, so you can have that one. And then you can have that one. Do we paint you? Yes, we can paint you now. Right, I'm going to wait to allocate these. Well, this one can be allocated straight away. Because I will have buses coming back in. So I got one for Kefili and one for Kodja Kamoi. Let's just import the paint. 
And this is going to be a, a this is going to be a branded like general one, so that can go with there. You can go on this bus. That one's been allocated, haven't it? Yep, that's been allocated. I really can't believe that I left passengers behind on the C1 this morning. Gonna have a lot of complaints about that. Let's just pause the game, because I want to review this, so... For the rest, it's fine. The P1 doesn't need anything bigger than that. Oh my god. Jesus. Whoa. I need to do something about that, don't I? The 100. Should have made that every half an hour. Could be quite good. But if I do that, I'm going to have to change the 103. I'm going to have to change the timers on the 103. Because then we'll have two buses going up together. Maybe, then maybe we'll be that such a bad thing, you know? If I change the setting so that it runs on 55... We'll do that, Monday to Saturday. And then where's the 100? We'll edit that timetable. So this one will be every half an hour. Because it, it needs it, doesn't it? It really does need it. And then... I think that should be okay. So if we confirm that. So that won't come into effect though straight away, unfortunately. But oh, it is what it is. So it is what it is. Um, Let's assign this one. You need a bigger bus, so I'll just give you that one. Kaja Kamoid, they've all been assigned, so I'm going to have to wait until one comes in. Look at the waiting time. <laughs> oh my god. I need to employ another service employee. So if we hire my employees, they're on 12.50 an hour, so let's hire you. And then let's open this desk, just so they can help out. Actually, tell you what, I'm going to hire... I'm going to hire two more service employees so that they get adequate breaks in between because otherwise they're just super stressed. Um, your skill isn't the best, so if we do that. I'm keeping an eye on the allocation, so don't worry. There we go. Okay, that should help with the amount of people that are simply waiting, just standing about in the foyer. Right, have I got any buses coming in yet? I haven't. Come on, where are you? <laughs> this is not good. I need some buses. We're making a lot of money. It's only 12 o'clock and I've already made that amount. It's crazy. Right. It's getting a bit touching cloth by her. Um, let's give you let's give you that one. Because it does need a bigger bus on the 100. I don't want to leave any passengers behind again. You can have a small bus. Right, where are my... Come on, where are my branded 102s? Has that one been allocated? Yeah, that one's been allocated. Here we go. 102. And then I need to allocate this for the C1. So when an unbranded comes in, I'll be able to allocate that. Here we go. Allocate that one. What's wrong with it? An indicator. Oh, that shouldn't go out on the road, technically. Okay, um, that shouldn't go out on the road. It's got an indicator out. So what we'll do... Oh, we can't now, though. Because I've already allocated it. I should have had a look first. <laughs> My bad. Um, here we go. Let's give you that one. Oh, it's quite big. Turnout's really busy, isn't it? Very, very busy. Right, let's get you repaired. Needs a new light, tyres, and a V-belt. Let's get you repaired as well. You need brake pads and tires. I tell you what, let's give you, let's give you everything. Um, and then we'll wash, clean, and refuel you as well. You can have a refuel, clean, and a wash as well. Wow, well, let's stay on my buses. <laughs> I need to unlock the automatic cleaning of them because it just it'll make everything so easy. Hey, hope I, we can maintain the current circumstance. I'm really happy at the moment. Good, I'm really happy about that. My ratings are going up as well. Is good. The valley travel should get a grip on this process. I expect much more. We'll go and catch a taxi then, mate. Why do the bus on the 100 run so infrequently? Because it's not in service. You know, it's, it's the very first one. It doesn't need to be regular service, that. It's the first one. 
I can cancel that if I really wanted to, you know? So don't, you know, don't star me, passengers. Don't star me now, okay? <laughs> right, let's see how we're doing. So I'm going to keep an eye on the, on the allocations. See, ooh. Look at that, every 20 minutes. Look how many passengers we're having. That's, that's a lot. <laughs> that's a heck of a lot. Uh, this P1 seems to have picked up. The 100 is a bit of a is a bit of a ball ache for me at the minute. So hopefully with it with it ready every half an hour tomorrow, that will make it a lot better. 101 University. That's doing okay. 102. Passengers have picked up on that. 103. Passengers are picking up on that as well. 104, yeah, wow, look at that. Lot of passengers. Lot of passengers. I think it's probably a good idea that we increase it every half an hour on that one. The 105, wow. Might have to make it every 30 minutes between them three. So I think that's what we'll do. 112, every half an hour. Seems to have done the trick on that one with every half an hour rather than every hour. Say, so, no, we increase that every 20 minutes. So yeah, that's fine in the minute. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. I'm going to miss Alec. I'm going to miss turn out. <laughs> Here we go, and then College of Camoys. Here we go. Um, so, yeah, what I want to have a look at, I want to have a look at um, the 105, didn't I? So, that one, um, and a timetable. So, during busy periods, it's going to run every half an hour. So, if we increase that to 7 o'clock, and we make that 6, so we're making it more reliable that by doing this as well. So, even though it's going to drain my resources... One thing I'm really impressed with is how, just how much money I've made. It's like, this has been my best day so far. 70,000, 70,000 so far. And it's only, what, like 7 o'clock? So, and I've got a lot of busts on the network right now. And it just, it, this just makes me, okay, and I'm not going to lie to you, okay. This makes me super happy. It really does. Now, an idea I've got, which I explained in the previous episodes. Let me just allocate that, because otherwise if I babble on too much, I'm not going to be able to tell you. Um, just give him that one. So, yeah. So, I've got an idea for the for the Nelson, because I feel really bad for the people of Nelson. Because they're just, they're being battered by people in Trachlan and, and Kilvanim. So, next episode, we're going to we're gonna introduce another route. Okay, it's going to start from Pontypridd. It's going to go all the way up here, but it's not going to go through Kilvanim or... Um, the Oaklands or anything like that. It's going to go up the A470, the Link Road. And the first stop is going to be by there, Fiddler's Elbow. And then it's going to go into Nelson. And then it's going to come all the way down through Ustred Menach, Lambranach, into Kefili. That is going to be our next route that we're going to do. That should then increase our bus network to the uh, to the desired 63%. They'll probably do it even more. So that is the plan for the next episode. So let me just allocate these two turns and then we'll probably call it a day so because there's been quite a lot done in this episode so <laughs> God, we could put a van on that one <laughs> and then this one college of kamoi let's put a branded one on it again let's give you that one but yeah a lot a lot of information in this episode but it's been a really fun episode if you ask me so if you have enjoyed the episode guys remember please leave me a like down below and comment what you think in the comments down below but at the same time, if you didn't like it, feel free to leave me a dislike as well. I have got Discord, which is an ever-growing community. So if you did want to join it with a fellow human being such as yourself, who are amazing, by all means, the link will be down below. And not to mention, my Patreon is linked down below as well. So if you did want to join my Patreon, which will give you exclusive perks and early access you know, to my content in general, then have a look at Patreon. But until then, guys, have a great day. Take very good care of yourselves. And I will see you in day 11. Bye.